Hey, welcome, Educating Duke. I mentioned that it's almost time for his first cowboy race coming up here in about four days. And so I was going, I had planned to go over to my friends to practice and we got rained out. So in lieu of that, what I've done here today is set up some obstacles here outside the arena and I'm gonna simulate my own cowboy race. And I have not let him see this stuff, although he has seen most of it, but it's been a long time. So I decided I wanted to just do this without letting him get used to it. I want to find out how he's going to be because when I go to the race this weekend, he doesn't get to go sniff it before the race starts. He has to just go in there and do it. And uh, if he does have problems with something, then I'll, I'll take time to work through it. That is practice. But I just want to see how he does. So first of all, I'm going to open this gate. There are some things that you're always going to have in a cowboy race. You're always going to have a gate. You're always going to have some kind of a water crossing. You're always going to have some kind of bridges. You're always going to have some kind of pool noodles. Uh, you're always going to have some kind of uh, bridges. I said bridges, didn't I? And then there's a whole bunch of other things. You never know if you're going to have them or not. Um, almost always some roping of some sort, some dragging of something. I don't have all that set up today but I've got some of it. So first thing is I'm gonna ride him over here to this flag and see if I can carry this flag. He hasn't seen this flag in months and when he did see it, it was before I started riding him. I just showed it to him from the ground. So I've never tried to carry it from his back. Okay. All right, he didn't seem too bothered by it. So let's see what he does when I pick it up. Good. Good. So since this is practice, I'm going to take just a little bit of time and let him see that. Let him sniff it if he wants to. I won't be able to do that in the actual competition, of course. I mean, I could, but I won't. <laughs> Hopefully, won't need to. Okay, good. He seems fine with that. So now, I'm just going to... Usually, when we have a flag carry, it'll be carry it around something and put it back. And it's pretty windy today, which it'll likely be windy on the day of the, uh, of the race. It's kind of one of those Murphy's Law things. It's always windy unless it's 100 degrees and then there's no breeze at all. <laughs> okay, he's doing great. I, ideally, I would want to do this at a lope. Uh, but on this first race, I, I, it doesn't need to be that way. If he gets through it without losing his mind over anything, That'll be a big win as far as I'm concerned. I am not going to put a lot of pressure on him, make a big thing about it, okay? Uh, I'm gonna walk over here to this tire, which you may not be able to see. It's behind here. Okay, right there, he got a little scared because the wind blew the cowboy curtain that's behind me. And, uh, but it wasn't too bad. Ooh, good boy. Good boy, so he put his front feet in here. Um, eventually, I'll want him to do spins and yield his hindquarters around this. I might be able to get a few steps here. Let me see if I can get him to step over just a few steps. That's actually pretty good. Good, okay. So I'm gonna walk out of this and let's see what we get with this cowboy curtain. See if he'll ride under it without getting too scared. Now I'm holding a handful of mane, okay. And I'm going to let him ride beside it. That's pretty good. And he came back under it on his own. <laughs> I would prefer that not to be so windy because I want it to hit him in the face. That's the idea. But again, you never know what's going to happen on race day. So that's pretty good for a young fella. All right. Oh, good. I'm going to grab it and touch him with it. This guy is a superstar. All right. We'll take that, Duke. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to trot over here to these poles. And I moved all of this stuff around yesterday, so he's not seen these poles in this configuration. I want him to just trot over these poles without hitting any of them. Which he didn't. Okay. So again, since this is practice, I'm going to come around and do it again. That would not have gotten me a very good score at the at the race because he hesitated and then he 
clipped him with his feet because he was hesitating and not, not going over it with energy, so let's try it again. Much better. Much better. Good boy. Better. Okay, now I'll try the pool noodles. Again, he hasn't seen these since last fall, in six months probably. I just want him to walk through them. Good boy. Excellent job. Excellent job. All right, now let's try the trash box. And I put a bridge in front of it. You never know what kind of combination you're gonna get at a cowboy race. Come on, bud. Okay, so that was not very good, but he did something. So out of 10 points, I'd get about one <laughs> for that one right there. <laughs> Let's see if we can get it up to three or four. Nope, okay. So this is practice, so I get to keep trying until we get something going here. No, 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 no. Okay. When you're teaching this, you do not want to turn your horse away from the obstacle. You don't want to turn around and come at it again. That doesn't help you. Good boy. I think you can get this. Come on. I think you can do it. Come on, buddy. Come on. Good boy. Come on. <laughs> I knew you could do it. Okay. So we got up to about two and a half points out of ten. <laughs> All right. Uh, Next, let's come around and try this bridge here from the difficult side. Should be okay with this. This one we've done a lot. I'm gonna try these narrow bridges. I've reconfigured them so he's not seen them in this particular configuration. And you always wanna come at these obstacles as straight as possible. Could have been a little straighter, but good boy. Okay. His back foot stepped off. Nope, 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 nope. So he jumped off of that because he didn't want to do it, but he knows how to do this. Come on, bud. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> That's pretty good right there. That's pretty good. That'd be a really nice score. It wasn't perfect, but it was pretty nice. Pretty nice. I'm going to stop and rub on him and love on him a minute. Then we'll do a couple more. So overall, I'm reasonably happy. Uh, the only one he's really struggled with has been the trash box. The rest of these, he's been okay. Okay. So last thing, let's try that trash box from the other direction. Let's give him a chance to try this again from the other way. Nope. There you go, good boy. Excellent job. Excellent job. Excellent job. Okay. So overall, I'm pretty pleased with him today. I expect a similar kind of a performance on his first uh, his first event. It's possible that we'll get there and he'll be a lot more anxious and he won't do as well as he did here, but I kind of think he will. We'll see. We'll see. I'll do my best to get everything videoed and show it to you guys. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at you, buddy. There you go. 